Hello and welcome to the video by me, the Raspberry Pi Guy. Today is the 14th of March, a date that is also known as Pi Day. To celebrate this occasion, the Raspberry Pi Foundation has just released their latest product, the Raspberry Pi 3 Model B Plus. An update to the popular Raspberry Pi 3 Model B, the new Pi comes with a host of improvements, such as a 1.4 GHz clocked processor, better thermal performance, and faster Ethernet networking. Let's take a look. From first sight, the Pi 3B Plus doesn't look too different from the Pi 3 Model B, and this is quite deliberate. It is clear that this new model is an incremental improvement upon last year's. The board retains the same form factor that has been present since the original Raspberry Pi B Plus, with its 85 by 56 by 17 mm credit card size layout. At the center of the Pi 3 B Plus, we have an improved CPU called the BCM 2837B0. This is a revision of the old BCM2837 on the previous model, with the main difference being that it has an improved power supply to the ARM processors. This means that it is still a quad-core 64-bit ARM core text chip, but has had a clock speed boost from 1.2 GHz to 1.4 GHz. This leads to a real-world performance boost that's been reported to be between 15 and 30%. The Pi 3B Plus still has the same Video Core 4 graphics unit and familiar 1GB of DDR2 RAM. Around the board you'll find the usual Full HD HDMI port, 4 USB 2.0 ports, micro USB power and 3.5mm audio jack. Coming around to the Ethernet side of things though, we have some changes. And it is good news as there is now Gigabit Ethernet. However, this Gigabit Ethernet is connected over USB 2.0 and consequently has a communication speed limited to around 330 megabits. This is still a significant improvement over the 100 megabit ethernet found on earlier models of Raspberry Pi. In order to support this upgrade, the USB hub chip on the board has now been updated. You can read on the silicon that it is actually a LAN 7515 from microchip. Excitingly, the foundation has also announced that there's upcoming support for power over ethernet. This will be facilitated with some extra hardware that interfaces with the Pi 3B Plus using this new header located next to the USB ports. At launch, this hardware isn't available, but it should be in stock soon. There's currently not any news on what this external PCB add-on will look like or its price, so you're going to have to watch this space for more information on that. The Pi 3B Plus continues to have wireless LAN and Bluetooth, which is now located underneath this metalized can, embossed with the Raspberry Pi logo. The Pi now has support for 80211 AC wireless LAN, allowing for 5 GHz communications. This means that, along with the 330 megabit Ethernet connectivity, the new B Plus also has 100 megabit Wi-Fi capability. In general, there have been many other engineering improvements. The heat spreader on top of the processor, as well as PCB enhancements, has improved thermal performance significantly. Consequently, unlike with previous models, you'll find that heat is dissipated from all over the board, rather than concentrated just from the CPU. The 40-pin GPIO header remains untouched, as well as the microSD card slot for storage. Like usual, the Pi 3B Plus retains compatibility with all previous models. The processor improvement means that Raspberry and feels nippy and responsive, running on the new hardware, with greater ability to multitask and run demanding software. All of these changes have come at a price increase of precisely $0, meaning that the latest Pi is available for the exact same price that the first Pi retailed for in 2012, a mere $35. The Raspberry Pi Model 3B Plus is a refinement of the winning formula that the Raspberry Pi Foundation has been developing for the last six years. The new Pi has some great improvements and all within the same form factor and budget. You can pick one up now, so check the description for a link. That's all we have time for today, but don't forget to follow me on Twitter at RaspberryPiGuy1 to keep up to date with the latest news. Also, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. Thanks for watching, and until next time, bye!